as far as real estate prices going up is concerned i think it's a, the, it's the most favorite topic that uh, we all talk and we talk year after year the same topic and uh, uh, traditionally historically uh, i think real estate prices have never gone down by and no means uh, the prices have ever gone down so this is historic and especially in india where we witnessed reforms in the last 25 years since 1991 uh, the entire landscape of the country has changed the economic scenario has changed the consumer scenario has changed the land reforms uh, 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 have been coming into place uh, the developments have been happening there's a lot of urbanization which is happening so therefore uh, and there's a lot of infrastructure work which has happened in the last 25 years and it is only going to continue for the next 25 years so uh, from any angle that you will see uh, the prices going up or reaching an unaffordable affordability point uh, has always been a matter of uh, discussion industry corrects itself at some point and then again back into the uh, ask you a very okay. simple question there was a time that people used to have a cup of coffee for 25 paisa and 50 paisa and today we go have a cup of coffee for 150 rupees uh, in any of the coffee shops so i don't think anybody really makes a noise about why a coffee is selling at 150 rupees or a 250 rupees in a, in any uh, uh, star hotel or whatever but definitely real estate is always one thing that everybody wants to question is why the prices are higher so it comes with multiple things one the prices are associated with demand and supply two it is related to the development that is happening in any particular area or a city or a suburb uh, three it also it also is connected to the input cost for example land is an input cost the uh, steel cement and the uh, cost of construction entire thing is an input cost the new dimension that which has happened in the last few years is the taxation so taxation has added a heavy amount of cost including stamp duty registration service tax vat and uh, the whole uh, gamut of things so with all this going up so uh, blaming as to why the prices are higher uh, and pointing fingers only at a developer i think it is a very unreasonable uh, way of looking at if you ask me uh, a there is nothing that the government has a solution as a one line solution either from the government or from the industry to say if this happens everything else will get sorted there is no such thing because uh, government has its own compulsions policies are made by different different governments successive governments and uh, it is also a reflection of so the current the ground reality the changing uh, scenario uh, these states and the center are constantly uh, also part of the changes which are happening and therefore it will have its impact on real estate as well real estate is one of the as, uh, areas in the country which will have a huge imp impact and the government so far has been getting a good share of revenues in terms of taxes coming to them by way of uh, the taxation especially the revenue uh, side so hopefully that will now change with gst coming in there is going to be a plus or minus uh, 2 to 3 percent impact on the uh, overall taxation and that should rationalize uh, in terms of the taxation across the country because currently the real estate taxes are different from state to state it kind of varies so uh, a lot of it is going to get addressed hopefully with the for every GST budget coming. the industry also uh, keeps appealing to the government making uh, representations through various bodies where we should get an industry uh, status so these discussions happen at different institution level different ministry level and different uh, government level uh, but it has taken its time so possibly uh, real estate getting a industry status uh, maybe i see that happening post uh, rera implementation uh, maybe real estate would get a industry state status sooner than later that could possibly have a positive impact because that will change the way the funds are being made available to an industry which is currently different as far as real estate is concerned because of the uh, perception of risk by the institution.